Thanks for coming. Um, let's have a seat. So tell us about Soundhound. Tell us about your business. Tell us about what you're solving for as a company. Yeah, so Soundhound is a, a voice AI, the only independent voice AI company that's helping businesses across multiple industries uh, integrate their conversational AI into their products and services. Uh, we were founded in 2005. Our founders, you know, founded actually in Stanford in the, in the dorm room. Um, and over the last 17 years, you know, we became a public company. We're, we're, we deliver our technology in 38 languages to some of the biggest brands like Mercedes, Pandora, Snapchat, and Vizio. What's your experience been like on the cloud overall? Like, how, how has the company evolved, and, and what have you done in terms of taking advantage of cloud infrastructure? Yeah, so obviously, you know, we've, we've been on the cloud for, for, for quite a while, um, and in, with various vendors, we've, we've pretty much tried them all. And I think they all have their, their own limitations, whether it's, you know, kind of some rigidity around the architecture, some complexity around um, setup. And I think some of the, the more notable challenges are around performance. When you get to scale, you find some underlying um, challenges within that. We've definitely run into those issues um, al along the journey, I think, you know, and obviously moving to OCI has been, you know, I think really beneficial for us from both the performance, you know, as a scale standpoint, we're, we're doing a couple of billion, billion transactions um, you know, a year, and um, you know, we have to have millisecond response times. And of course, we're, we're doing, so we're doing a lot of training and inferencing we're using bare metal GPU, GPUs, and, and we've seen a 50% lift on the performance of that, as well as a cost savings. And for us, the cost savings you know, and the performance lift is, is really important for us because we're hitting that hyper growth. And so as we grow, we don't want our cost to exponentially grow, and we need our, our system's performance to stay at this millisecond level. Um, it's because something like voice, which is extremely complex, requires, you know, sub-second response times every single time. And, you know, if you, if you were to say uh, what's the best aspect of the transition you, you've had or the experience you've had with OCI overall, how would you frame that? What would, what would your... Yeah, I, I mean, I, I think, so, you know, one of the... Most people would be surprised. Like, I think as a partner, Oracle's been fantastic to work with. Like, the people at Oracle have been tremendous. I think the technology, you know, you guys... Security first is built in, and security is really important to us. You know, our voice data is PII. Um, our IP is extremely, you know, we put $400 million into building our, our IP. So the security, the scalability has been phenomenal in terms of the resilience and, and performance. And, and what's next for Soundtown? Uh, we got big ambitions. Like, like I said, we're, we're at that knee of the curve. <laughs> mm -hmm. we're, we're growing into multiple industries. We're doing a lot of work in the restaurant space. And actually, you know, I think this is one of the, talk about partnering with Oracle. Oracle has a big uh, food and beverage industry, which, you know, we've been introduced to through our account manager. And we've, we've met a number of folks internally at Oracle and introduced even some of their clients, or your clients, I should say. And, uh, you know, we're, we're continuing to grow. We went public this year. And so we've got a a bright journey ahead of us. Uh, a lot of work to do. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> tough market to do it in, but you know we're we're at that, that juncture, and uh, we're we're really excited about the future. Okay. Well, thank you very much. Thanks for having us. Really great to hear about your experiences. Thank, thank you. you.